Good morning, San Diego is focusing on the positive. And right now, something so special is happening to this family in Mira Mesa, the Fernandez family, uh, who is being blessed in every way possible by little Tommy's breaking and entering drive through Christmas. Yeah, and Madison Sinclair has been out there all morning, keeping an eye on the action. Good morning, Maddie. All yeah, right, good morning. Side, you know, we're going to maybe move away from these speakers in just a bit. But yes, we are here. The family was just surprised at the top of nine o'clock and the cars have just not stopped. And they're just coming and coming, dropping off all these beautiful gifts, all these amazing gifts. If you can pan over to the right and just look at the pile, it is getting bigger and bigger as the hour goes on and as more and more cars come by. But we do have little Tommy here. You, you know, you organize this whole event. Can you tell us what is going on? Well, we, you know, the family right there in the pajamas, that's uh, Chloe, that's Skylar, and that's Kingston. And if you're wondering who else everybody else is, that's all their cousins. They all live together, you know, nearby, and that's why they're, you know, together. And uh, they're here to support uh, the memory of that young man right there on, on, on the, right there in the front of the house is a photo of Mr. Herb Fernandez, who passed away in August. And this is the very first Christmas without their daddy. And, uh, and this, I believe, they will remember for the rest of their lives. You know, when I was five years old, my dad died. And when I opened that front porch that very first Christmas, I saw a box of toys. And that set me up for the rest of my life. So let's see what this does for these guys. And uh, I have a feeling uh, uh, they're going to they're gonna remember this day forever. I al already see them, you know, smiling and having a great time. That whole family right there, you know, that's Filipino family. That's the Filipino community of, uh, of Mira Mesa. And they're all here to support their, uh, their brother. Their brother, Mr. Herb Fernandez, graduated in the 90s at Mira Mesa. And uh, we're, this parade is going on and on. We had a police escort, you know, Northeastern Division of the San Diego Police Department. And uh, fire station number 38 is ending the parade with another Santa Claus. And uh, we're just going to bring... We're going to bring joy. And Jesse? So, Tommy, you, you, you missed a moment. Reagan, the the wonderful girl that wrote the letter about Chloe and her family, just pulled up. She was hanging out the roof of her sunroof with a sign. Uh, Chloe went out, took a picture with them. It was really where it all started. It was it was such a great moment. Such a great Cindy. moment. So, um, so we're right over here. Let's go over here to this car. Yo, Cindy. Oh, <laughs> Let's go over here. This is a... Uh, you know, we got a parade, so at a, in every parade, there's always a professional baseball player. And uh, this is Mark Sweeney. Mark Sweeney. Mark Happy Sweeney holidays. and his family. Happy and that's Cindy Whitmarsh. Hi. Cindy Whitmarsh. Kevin. So they're Say part hi. of the parade. Hi, and guys. Gavin. What up, Gavin? So awesome. All right. This so is thank such you a to, great thing. Thank you to the Sweeney family. Thank you to Cindy and uh, Gavin for showing up. Thank you. you. Know, I gotta ask you guys, you've been in line. How long has this line been taking you to get to this point? It, it doesn't really matter today. This is about uh, making uh, them happier and, and the happy holidays too, for sure. Well, for you waiting that long just shows how many people are out here for you to you know, drive all the way up here. All the people in front of you, all the people that are behind you, all the gifts that we're seeing out there piling up. It's just an, It's an incredible, incredible showing and it's well worth it. This is so exciting. Well, thank you for being a part of this and have a happy Hi holidays. Happy holidays. Well, the, the cars are just growing out here. It's just, it is just an ex incredible yeah. experience. And I was talking to the, the mom earlier and, you know, and the kids and they were just like, they had no idea and just, they're just so happy. Today is Christmas morning for them. Yeah, you know, we, when we woke up, we didn't know how many cars would show up, but a lot of cars did. And this is the San Diego spirit. This is the holiday spirit. And it's right here on KUSI on, you know, Star 94.1. And uh, this is gonna, this is gonna be a day they'll always remember. It really is. I mean, check this out. There's baseball players, you know, there's even Brian Quinn of the San Diego Padres, uh, San Diego Soccers, he's here. And uh, so many people are here to uh, bring joy and happiness to this family. From Man. all over San Diego County. How did, and I want to know, how did you guys land on this family? You know, we got about, uh, sorry that I'm holding up my mask. There's a, <laughs> we received about 700 letters. And uh, when I, when we read this letter, we literally heard a symphony in our ear saying, you know what? This young man was only 40 years old. He passed away and uh, he leaves behind a beautiful wife and three kids. And they're right, right there. They're having the best time of their life with their family and their cousins. And, uh, and that's what it's all about. Okay. That's what this is all about. Right there's the Christmas tree. And right over there are all the gifts that are piling up. 
And uh, that's all their family. All those people right there, that's the that's the Fernandez family. Uh, and we're just bringing joy to this family. And this is so cool that KUSI uh, allowed us to do this. Allowed us to do this. And look at that. Look at that. There, there's music in there. <laughs> oh, my gosh. How cool is that? We got music. Music's always part of the parade. A whole keyboard set up in someone's car just to bring <laughs> that extra smile on someone's face, a little bit more joy here uh, and for the breaking and entering. drive through parade. There you go. It's different this year because of this pandemic, and you didn't let this pandemic stop you. No, because we could have easily have said, hey, you know what? You know, because traditionally what we do is we, uh, through the years, we break into a home, and we go into their home, and we set up Christmas, <laughs> and they come back. But not this time. Because of the pandemic and because of all that's going on, we had to revise our plan. And what we did was we decided let everybody stay in their car, everybody mask up. You know, the only ones that can be part of this is the family. That's all their cousins. Um, right here, we just opened up a, so a trunk and a bunch of balloons came out. And this is it. Every single car, every single car that's part of this parade represents the spirit of San Diego. And, that, and that's equal to all that goes on with KUSI, all that goes on with iHeartRadio and Star 94.1. And together we can still bring the spirit of Christmas, bring spirit of the holidays to a family in need. And yes, this is happening to this one family today. But once this is over, we bring joy and happiness to other families as well. Let's move the parade along, guys. Let's move it. You know, and then, you know, we do have a... You know, like we had Mark Sweeney and Cindy Whitmarsh there, professional baseball players. We have football players. We have so many people in this parade, you know, led by a police escort. That was really cool to have uh, Northeastern Division of the San Diego Police Department uh, lead the parade. And we had a slow procession to the Fernandez house and all the neighbors are out. All the neighbors are watching. We even have uh, uh, people ready to sing songs, you know, for the Fernandez family once this is over. Uh, we're going to decorate their house, and uh, and everyone's here. All you know, from people that are struggling themselves uh, to people that uh, you know own businesses, they're all here to support and to show that we can have the San Diego spirit, the Christmas spirit, here in San Diego. Well, there you have it. Here, you know, with all the cars that we saw out at Mira Mesa High School, I this is going to go on for a while. There was so many people that showed up just for this family to give back, to bring joy, to celebrate this special Christmas morning for this family. So we're going to be out here all morning long, keep you updated, and have some fun stories coming up soon. I'll send it back over to you. <laughs> oh, Madison, just fantastic. And, and you know what? The nine-year-old girl, Reagan, who wrote... The letter, I have actually met her before, and she is such a sweet and kind and caring soul. And I think that that is so incredible that she wanted to do this for her friend. And look, look at what happens I when know. you go and say, hey, I want to help somebody in need, and look at the response from the community. Well, San Diegans, uh, you know, big shout out to every San Diegan mm -hmm. who was part of this, is part of this, coming from all corners of the county, oh, no, 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 of course, no, 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 and in style, too. How about that keyboard oh. in that van, Madison? How cool was that? I, live music I'm from telling inside you, the van. Between that and Mother Goose hanging out in the car, I mean, you've seen everything there this morning. But like we've said, it's not just those marquee names. It's people who are also struggling, who are giving back to the community. And that, this is San Diego. This is what we are all about, yeah. and that is what this is showcasing this morning. So important in a time where we all just need some holiday cheer. So. Absolutely, absolutely. Well, with that, uh, we're getting you, hopefully, into the holiday spirit. There is a family right now that is well, get, getting a lot of love. I mean, it's just such an understatement. Yeah. I mean, I don't know how else to explain it. There's just so much beautiful there's so many beautiful things happening right now on Mira Mesa right the community coming together for little Tommy's breaking and entering drive through Christmas Maddie Sinclair she's been out there all morning bringing us a live look good morning Madison good morning yeah the cars have not stopped they just get there's more and more cars and the 
the stack of gifts. Last time you saw us, that, there was only a couple out there. Now it's just like taking over the entire driveway. It is a good event out here. It is so fun. Uh, just giving back for a family in need during this holidays and during a pandemic. You know, so many people are struggling out there, and there's one family that will actually get to spend Christmas this year. Tommy is joining us, and you, you know, you put this all this event on. This is an annual event for you. Tell us about it. Well, I wouldn't say I put it together. I'd say San Diego put this together. You know, we found a family in need, and with the help of KUSI, with the help of iHeartRadio and Jesse and Tati and Star 94.1, we, uh, we uh, are bringing the Christmas spirit, the holiday spirit, uh, to this family. And this family is right here. That's Mom. And if I may, Mom, that's Kira, that's Chloe, that's Kingston, and that's Skyler. And um, you know what? We're going to play a song. That's my friend Marissa Grace. And uh, she's going to play you guys a song. All right, so what is your name and what are you going to sing for us? I'm Marissa Grace McRoberts and I'm going to be singing Winter Wonderland right now. Oh, thank you so much. This song's for you guys. This song's for you. Beautiful sight, we're happy tonight Walking in a winter wonderland Gone away is the bluebird Here to stay is a new bird He sings a love song as we go along Walking in a winter wonderland In the meadow we can build a snowman Pretend that he's Parson Brown He'll say, are you married? We'll say, no man But you can do the job when you're in town Later on, we'll conspire As we dream by the fire To face unafraid the plans that we've made Walking in a winter Oh, good job. Thank you so much. Thank you. Hey, hey, Kira, can I ask you something? You know, as, as you see all this happening because uh, your children were uh, on the nice list, uh, what goes through your mind when, when you see this outpouring of love? Merry Christmas. Um, Thank you, guys. I just... Yes, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, I'm, just, I'm just so overwhelmed and so thankful. And, I mean... I was happy to be alive. We've always felt the love for Mira Mesa. I came here from Montana 16 years ago, and my husband and his family and friends just welcomed me from the very start, and Mira Mesa is an amazing community. But I don't know if you can understand the what it means to have something like this when you've lost somebody that you love so much, and that this is so special. I don't even I don't even know what to say. If you could take us back to that moment when you, you know, got the call from finding out that you were going to be the family for this breaking and entering, and your oh, reaction. Man. Um, just shock, because I knew, I mean, I've heard, you know, about the, the breaking and entering before, and I knew that there had to be so many people, and so many people in need, especially right now because of COVID and the, the pandemic, and people are struggling right now, and so to be the ones picked was beyond anything right, I could right. ever imagine. And just knowing that my family, my kids, who are the most important thing in my life, are going to have this memory that they'll never forget. And who is this in your hands? This is Kingston. Hi, Kingston. Can you say hi real quick? Can you say hi? <laughs> Maybe a little shy. <laughs> yeah, he's five. And he, uh, he loves Christmas just like the rest of us. Who doesn't? It's a joyful time. You probably have a big sm smile on your face, ready to go for this Christmas morning for you. Over here, I want to take you up uh, to a legendary soccer player. This is uh, the legendary Brian Quinn. And uh, Brian, what's up? How you doing? Tommy, thanks very much for the invite. This is the best two hours I spent this week. And this is America that we all remember. This is what it's about. Coach, thank and you, and Tommy. It looked like the family knew you. Yeah, yeah, it looked yeah, like yeah. That's soccer's everywhere. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, well, Tommy. God bless you, Coach. Appreciate it. Appreciate All right. It. Happy okay. holidays. And then over here, you know, yes, this is the Mira Mesa community. This is the Filipino community. But everyone's coming from all over the county, including the mayor of San Marcos. The mayor of San Marcos, this is Rebecca Jones. Rebecca, how does it feel to be part of this? 
It's amazing. Uh, the pour, outpouring of love today. This is what Christmas is about. It's about loving everyone, but especially coming together when we, we find people that are in need, that need our love and support. And it's such an honor to be here for today for you, Kira, and your family. And um, just God bless you. And and just hopefully this, this whole spirit of loving and supporting you just lasts for as long as you need it. Okay. All right. You take care. Love you. And then if we go over here. Oh, Look so who many, it is. This is uh, oh, Casey McKinnon. Hi. Good morning, Casey. Hi, you know, Maddie. I was watching you live, Maddie, as Tommy went and opened the door, and it brought tears to my eyes. I mean, I've never been a part of the breaking and entering, so I decided to bring my sidekick with me this morning. This is Maverick. Maverick, Maverick say hi to everybody. Tommy, well done. This is the coolest thing to be a part of. And I was, I thought I was late, but there's about another hundred cars behind me. This has been going on for so long and well done, everybody. Casey, if you could <laughs> guesstimate how long you've been waiting in line. Um, well, I got to Mira Mesa High School about eight and it's 9.53 right now. So we've been sitting and waiting and that was just the coolest thing to see the family out here with the rest of their family, just supporting them and bringing them the best Christmas that they'll remember forever. And so. that just shows you how many people are out here. Thank you so much, Casey. Of Thank course. you, Maverick. Bye, guys. Have a great day. That just shows you how many people are out here wanting to support, wanting to bring that smile to someone's face. We're going to step out of the way just a little bit here so we, we don't get hit by any cars, but it's just so beautiful to see all these people out here showing up for a family, bringing that smile to a face. and. You know, celebrating Christmas morning just a little bit early here in San Diego. We're going to have more coming up about this breaking and entering put on by uh, Tommy and Star 94.1, Jesse and Tati as well. So stay tuned because we have a lot more to show you, a lot more to talk about as well. So send it back over to you guys for now. Oh, it's so nice to see. Like, you know, you have high-profile high San Diegans showing up, like Brian Quinn. Our own Casey McKinnon was there. Uh, of course, Mayor Rebecca Jones from San Marco. And all of the other just San Diegans who have shown up from just about every corner yeah. of the county. Um, and it's just wonderful. It's a beautiful thing. And it's going to continue going on this morning, and we'll continue to bring you live coverage. We're going to have more Good Morning San Diego coming back after this. There's little Tommy and uh, the rest of the gang. We continue with our coverage of little Tommy's breaking and entering Christmas drive through style. Yeah, and we've been watching these images for about an hour now since they surprised the Fernandez family this morning, bringing them Christmas. Hundreds of cars. I mean, hundreds and hundreds, really, yeah. at this rate is what it seems like. This line has been going nonstop with the San Diego community coming together to really give this family a Christmas they will remember. They have lost their fam their father this year, and so obviously a tough time for the family and San Diegans coming together to help out. Oh, look at how special this is. Families from all corners of the county are showing up. This is a parade, folks. It is a celebration, um, and they are showing lots of love lots of hope for this Mira Mesa family, the Fernandez family. Yeah, absolutely beautiful and, and just wonderful to hear um, from the family themselves and what this means to them, but also how, it, how amazing this is, how great San Diego is as we come together to shower them with some love. Hey, buddy, the elf is there, Santa is there, and we've got a lot more coverage and happiness coming your way in our 10 o'clock hour. We'll be right back. Talk to you and me.